Hello, Kevin Frost. Hello, Kurt. How are you? I am very well, my friend. Good to see you. Uh, joining uh, Kevin Frost here this morning is uh, Pat Desell, uh who put together a, uh, a, a film called Blind Ambition, all about you. How about that? Yeah, it's kind of cool, but about everybody else, too. Is that right? Yeah, Pat, about... how are you? I'm doing good. Good, good. Tell me about this film. It started out in Algonquin College as part of the television broadcasting program. We had to do a documentary, and um, I knew him from the local papers. Yeah, because so, he's world famous. Yeah, right? pretty much. That's how I know him. Yeah. And, <laughs> <laughs> and then you started working on this And then stuff. I started working on it, and there was an eight-minute version for school. And I just wanted to continue working on it because Kevin just had so many great traits and ideas and events that I had filmed. And we had a lot of footage, but I just wanted to create more. Yeah, him. yeah. Uh, for those of you who don't know my good friend Kevin Frost, he is a, uh, a deaf-blind speed skater, amongst other things, a runner, a Paralympian, all that sort of thing. What do you think about this, having a movie made about you? I think it's, uh, I look at it as the next step that's going to help my evolution on helping me, the sport become sanctioned and bringing awareness out to the people who are uh, in my shoes who are very hibernated. And I thought, why not have a, a movie to uh, show them that Things can be done, but best of all, it's it's all the people who who've helped me over the years make this are you, happen. Are they in the movie? Actually, no, the they won't be in the movie. But there's like there's sponsors, there's my PR team, and there's Pat. There's a lot of people that made this happen, and I think it's all about teamwork in our community. When you all everybody comes together, we can make amazing event like this happens. And uh, I think what the most important thing is uh, is. 12 years ago, I hit rock bottom by losing my job, losing my life, being told I had Usher syndrome. Usher syndrome is where you lose your hearing young and your vision later on. Uh -huh. And I was able to, with the help of a lot of great people, CNIB and, and my friends, I was able to conquer something that I never thought I would ever do. But now I'm a, t a world champion in short track and long track. And I think it's kind of cool to share it with uh, people who want to form their own dreams. And I really appreciate Pat and my great PR team uh, stepping up. Yeah. I think it's important to get that message out there, yeah. right? Yes, I think it's Because a dozen years ago, everything was all right. Correct, yeah, normal life and everything taken yeah. away. So but now everything's all right again. Well, you know what, life is always all right. Every day is a great day, and I think it, uh, depending how you look at life, of how it's all going to turn out. Did it, was it tough at first, like when you first found out what kind of situation you were faced with? Yes, I think it's... Uh, you, you weren't like, uh, okay, uh, I'm good with it. Not at first. No, it was... Uh, Pretty devastating, uh, just not knowing where you're going to go, what kind of income you're going to have, and it's kind of like the movie itself. Uh, yeah. uh, you, you're going into it blind and you just hope the best, but there's a lot, there's a lot of other great athletes out there who've accomplished great things. I'm just there to, to teach people who are in the same boat to uh, achieve what yeah. they want to. We're looking at some footage uh, from, uh, from the... Uh yeah. Is it documentary style, Pat? Is that how you went about yes, it? Yes, yeah. It's it's pretty much narrated completely by Kevin himself. Right. Him talking about himself and his life and his challenges. Right. All I, of his events. I right. think what's really important is to, if uh, people who are interested on May, sorry, October 18th at the uh, May Fair in Orleans, it, the doors will open at 7 and uh, at 7.30 is when the the movie will start, I think it's really, if anybody's interested in That's John. on the 18th? 18th of October, At correct. the Mayfair? In Orleans. In Orleans. Yeah. Well, that's a good idea. I want to see this. That would be awesome. You know? That's a, it's a good thing to see. Yeah, I think it's, uh, it's been a, a long, great hurdle, but you know what? Uh, well, I think it points out, you know, to other people who run into situations similar to yours, not necessarily exactly the same, because nobody would probably run into that exactly, no. but there's other issues that pop up in people's lives. <coughs> Excuse me, and uh, to see how you've handled your situation is inspiring, my friend. It's, it's just it's yeah, simply you. that, right? Yeah, no, it's pretty. Uh, and also, there's uh, some new news here. My little friend Nemo will be uh, retiring in about two to three weeks, so he's been with me for nine years. What happens with Nemo? Well, Nemo will be uh, uh, living with uh, uh, a beautiful lady in Orleans who's going to uh, take on Nemo, and I'll be getting a new dog from Canadian Guide Dog up in Manitix, uh, probably uh, in the next few months. Have you started that process yet? Yeah, it's a process. It's been uh, ongoing. I had uh, three puppies uh, last, last week come just to give it a, a speed trial to see what kind of speed I can... Uh, right. So, uh, but the most important thing here is uh, Nemo's a part of my life and uh, just shows you life goes on. Yeah. 
And with, is, the, with the movie, it's gonna, it's just gonna be amazing to see the outcome of the movie. Nemo's uh, <laughs> working days are over. Yeah, she's yeah. officially retired. Yeah. Listen, fellas, thanks for coming by. Well, thank thank you. you. October 18th is the premiere. Uh, and I'm looking forward to it. And it's at uh, the Mayfair in Orleans, you say? Correct. All right. Okay, how can you find out more information, Kevin? Thank you. Uh, how can you find out more info? Oh, sorry. Uh, on the website, um, uh, my website, and there's a website that'll be on the TV screen. Yep. Yeah, we saw and, it. And uh, you Frost can get the tickets. KevinFrost.wordpress.com. You can get the tickets online or you can get them at the door. And uh, I hope to see you there because uh, it's going to uh, be an amazing night. Good stuff. Thanks, guys. Thank Thanks you. for coming by. See you, Nemo. Good luck, my friend. <laughs> Good luck in your retirement. Nemo. Take a break. We'll be back.